Hey, what's up guys, Virtual Leaks here, back again with another video after about three weeks of not uploading on the channel. And that was because I was busy with my midterms in college. But I'm finally done with them, uh, at least for the next couple of weeks. And today I actually wanted to bring you guys a very quick video on how to enable the WhatsApp for web feature on your iPhone. Now, the only prerequisite here that you need to complete is that you need to be jailbroken. And that's pretty much it. So without any further delay, let's jump right into the video and see how to get the WhatsApp for web feature activated on your iPhone. Now, as most of you guys know that this feature of WhatsApp is not available on iOS by default. So we do need to install a Cydia tweak for this. And the tweak that we're going to install is called WhatsApp Web Enabler. And you can just go ahead and download it for free from the Big Boss repository on Cydia. And if I just go ahead and jump into the settings here, Now in this tweak settings the only thing you have is an enable or disable quilt switch and that's pretty much it. Now what you need to do is go ahead and open up WhatsApp and in the settings column here you now have a new option for WhatsApp web. And when you go ahead and open it up it's going to show you a QR code scanner and this point forward on your computer open up Google Chrome and before you guys ask me in the comments yes this will work only on Chrome. I've tried using it on Safari but it didn't work. Anyways, on Chrome, go to web.whatsapp.com and wait for a new QR code to appear. Now, go to that WhatsApp web QR code scanner and tap on got it as soon as it appears. And just go ahead and point your phone camera towards the QR code on the computer screen. And once you're done and once you're paired, all your conversations should appear on the computer. And to demonstrate that this actually works, let me just go ahead and send a message here in this group. And I'm just going to quickly type something here. And as you guys can see, as soon as I press enter and the message goes through, you can see the same message appears on my phone too. And this does work flawlessly. You do obviously get the replied messages on the computer too. And let me just go ahead and demonstrate this one more time. Now once you've actually paired your device, you also get a new option to sign out in the WhatsApp web settings uh, and that's pretty much covers up this tweak. So that's pretty much it guys, that is how you get the WhatsApp for web feature activated on your iPhone. If you like this video or if this video was helpful to you, make sure to give it a like rating down below. While you're at it, also make sure to subscribe to the channel as it helps me out and also makes you stay connected with all my latest tech content. Also, I'm a real social guy, so make sure to follow me on my social media networks, the links to which will be in the description of this video. That's been it. Thank you so much for watching, and I'll talk to you guys in the next one. Peace.